So today we're gonna do some genetic reshuffling and breeding using this fancy thing here. I've learned fun things because I bred this fella, Mr. Ragnarok. Look at this, he's an artisan, motivational leader, vanguard and swift, meaning this thing is crazy fast. Check out how much he can zoom, he's like super quick. I know there's probably better ones, but I'm excited for him anyway. Also for the couple of last days, I have been AFK farming overnight and I've generated nearly 20,000 ore, uh, the others at the base. And up here in our other base, we are getting lots and lots and lots of gold coins, which is good because I can buy things that are really expensive, like ammo. So if I manually clean up everything that they've been laying behind, you notice that I made like 2,500 gold and this was only a matter of like 15 minutes that they've been doing this. And over the weekend, I did make 23,000 more gold. So I have 69,840 right now. Actually, I think there's more in other chests here. Yeah, here's another 140. Woo! But it gave me an interesting idea because most of these little doggies are, or cats, I guess, they're all kind of trash. Dainty eater, work slave, motivational eater. Most of them don't have any good skills for working. But what would happen if we bred them? So my large brain said to myself, if I find a fox barks here with Lucky and Artisan, and according to the charts, the rib bunny mixed with fox sparks should make the kitty cats. Come here, little buddy. Oh, I didn't even check if these were male and female. That would be an issue. Oh, they are. Wow. So you get into here, and Mr. Fox Barks, you get into here, and then make some sort of weird little mutant child. Because our Ragnarok is making quite a bit of cake, and we need babies. Get busy. Please. Now, theoretically speaking, this guy with the Lucky and Artisan skills and her with the Sirius should give us a really, really, really good meow, if all of my numbers are correct. And while those pals are making babies, we can go over here to Fisherman's Point, which is way down on this corner of the map, and uh, this trader right here actually sells that rifle ammo for only 220 gold. So, like, we already got a lot of it just in that little bit of time. 14, I know it's not the best thing, but I'd rather use that than uh, our iron on making ammo. Also, this person sells people. Wow. 40,000 for the Reptiro. These guys don't even have good stats, but I could sell things to him. Like, the people. That gets awkward really quickly. Now, these two little lovebirds have pooped out two eggs, which still is weird. I'm hoping that this is the right combination. Also, my bird is stuck. You dingus, why do you get stuck in there? All right, let's tie this out. A damp egg doesn't make sense to me that it'd be a mal, but... Nope. That, that's a ping gullet. The, the, the chart I looked at was totally wrong. Aw, oh, that's annoying though. Let's see if this penguin works. Yeah, totally another penguin. All right, you two, I'm gonna have to pull you off your duty over here. No more of that for you. Let's save those cake, because they're expensive. Actually, they're not, they just take a lot of time. But I think the more interesting question is, are those penguins any good? Oh, this one got Lucky and Artisan. That's kind of awesome. And this one just got Lucky. All right, so it wasn't quite right. I need to find uh, the proper combination, I guess. So another combination that's recommended. Where'd they go? And isn't this right? Like a cat just finds the biggest bed that it can get and sleep on. This isn't a cat, but you know what I'm saying. All right, Fox Barks. So we're gonna take this little penguin. Don't worry, it's not a family member of the one that was just born. Get, get back here, dingus. I know you're excited at work, but you have more fun things to do. There you go, little buddy. Now get your carcass inside that. And then we're gonna bring out a shiny. Where's shiny at? You're trying to hide over here, buddy. You're just not allowed, because you're dumb. You can't figure out how to walk. A lot of pals get stuck either up in there or over here. I kind of wish they would fix pathfinding. I didn't even check if these were female or male. I should have. Is shiny a female? No, shiny's a male. That's not gonna work. Okay, so I think my chart is entirely off because a Sparks plus a Penguin should equal, well, it should be a meow, but <laughs> that was a shiny egg, not shiny. That was totally a Sparky egg. Also, I have a damp egg. I don't know where that came from, but that's gotta be a Sparkin. A Joltog, interesting. So yeah, my sheet is completely wrong. All right, Dingus, enough baby making. Come back in my inventory. But if I combine a ma with a Penguin, things should get interesting that way. All right, little ma, get yourself in here, make a baby. All right, not sure what this means, but we did get a frozen egg from them. Come on, Malchrist. Hey, we got a Malchrist. Ooh, Vanguard and Artisan with bottomless stomach. Not the best stats, but it should be pretty cool. 
So Vanguard is player attack and work speed. Not exact ones that I wanted. This is also a female, so that one's good. I guess I'm just gonna let these two frolic a little bit more and get a bunch more of these and then try to manipulate them together to get even better combinations. Also, I might set up another breeding facility. Well, good news, my friends. The breeding is going well. Thank you for asking. And I just got a new penguin. Look at these stats on this one. It's serious, artisan, lucky, and a workaholic, so it's sand drop slower. So now I can match this penguin with one of these mouse, and hopefully we can get some good crisps coming on. Those are words I never thought I'd ever say. So this is actually a decent one, the work slave. If we could get the workaholic instead of that, it'd be okay. Come on, little fella. Right into uh, this one. I gotta go take the other one out though. Bleep. You're not allowed to make babies. Not you, not anymore. You've done your part. All right, little kitty. Get yourself slapped into there, sort of. Float on the sky. They're grazing. Are you grazing? You're working. Okay, let's see if we have any cakes ready. We got one and a half. So I need to make some more wheat. Max that production up. And we'll come over here and I guess we'll keep that cake going. No one's working on it right now because the Ragnarok is stupid. Here, why don't you come over here? You make that. Actually, no, this guy will make it work. He's got level two fire. He likes breathing fire better. If I remember right, I think I captured a level three fire. Yeah, nope, a level four. This guy's pretty insane, actually. I got it from a giant egg, too. Watch this. Oh my goodness. And I don't want you to burn that. Here, make your make fight just right here. Get this one. <laughs> He's so big. Plus, I can get a mount for him. Look at how giant that thing is. I can't even quite make that mount yet though. 43, he's so fast. Nice, all right, come back in here. So everything right now is kind of locked. We need to get a bunch of cement if we're gonna get better pal balls. And that requires pal fluids and bones, which really sucks, I'll be honest. Thankfully, the merchants sell bones like crazy, but I'm generally unable to get pal fluids from anything besides actual living pals. So I'm gonna stock up on a little bit more rifle ammo, 190. He uses all my cash, but that should be okay because we can cover a lot of ground very quickly. Sorry, little chicken, didn't mean to do that. Oh, penguins, where are you? Oh, I could also tank him out. Should we try that? Hold on, I gotta take that little fella down first. Give me your ice organs and pal fluids. Thank you. And another penguin. And even more pal fluids. Great. This is going to take forever. Thankfully, they're kind of plentiful out here. My goodness. 3,400 crit. Sorry, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. He just had to watch his friend die. Oh, sorry, sirs. You believe you have one of my friends stuck in your cage. Might have to just eliminate you. And eliminate you. So yeah, the tornado doesn't hit you. Thank you. Thank you, Ragnarok. I need this guy for science purposes. Hello, little pal. I kind of feel bad. He's a mine foreman, which is kind of nice. You're gone. These penguins like hiding in the rocks around here. Ooh, you got away, little fella. Oh, well, I mean, try it again. Thank you. I believe these things also drop pal fluid. Do they? Oh, they do. That's too bad for them. Let's make them extinct. Now the question is, is that a shiny that I hear? Oh, a shiny elk deer. Um, okay, we can try this out. We might have to do this manually though. No, you can't do that to me. This is illegal. I want you to be my friend. Ow. How many hit points do you have? Go ahead, I don't, I don't really care. All right, let's try to capture you now. Doink. That should be easy enough. You got out? That's illegal. Ow! Hey, I captured it. Oh, it's a lucky one. Well, that makes sense because it's shiny and that's what it means. But I believe these guys also give pal fluids. Thankfully, it's like shooting ducks in a barrel. Do you think the ducks give water juice too? Maybe. Oh, you looked at your friend all sad and stuff. Oh, they do give pal fluids. This is easy enough. Cat on the tower. Got him. He fell down. I almost feel bad now. Almost. Thankfully, they respawn. This guy doesn't, though. He deserved that. I just saw something shiny out of the corner of my eye. Turns out to be a generically sized rocky egg. I kind of decided to take this guy on anyway. Mainly because he just has a lot of hit points and it gives me a lot of XP, which I really, really need right now. Yes, nice job with that huggy fire, buddy. Now the question is, do I tame him or do I just kill it? 
I guess we'll see what Kitty does. Oh, good job, Firefox. Hey, get in there. Whoa, all right, you don't like that ball. Take this one instead. An 11%? Yikes. I got better balls too. Want one of these? Nope. Those are really expensive. You should really get inside that thing. Fine, you can have one more. If you don't get inside this one, I'm gonna put this between your eyes. I'm gonna threaten you, and if it doesn't work, I swear I'll pull that trigger. Thank you. Did I get a bunch of XP? 17,000, I'll take that. And nine pal oil, which is expensive. All right, super good news. We have three more eggs over here too. So let's try hatching these things up. Let's start with that rocky one we found earlier, which gives me a mahangio, whatever those are. And then I found another common egg, which is kind of boring, but we're probably gonna get like another penguin out of it. Oh, our tokototo. All right, frozen egg number one. Hopefully this has got good steps for a Christ. Work slave logging format swift. That's pretty good, but not quite what we're looking for. Next one is, come on, give us good stuff. Ah, serious work slave pacifist and glutton. These aren't working right. Come on, need better. Ooh, artisan and clumsy. You guys are not giving me the right things right now. So I'll just put in this large scorching egg and get a les punk. Gross. So there's a few more eggs ready, but I need to get some refined ingots up and running. If I do about 50 each, or I can't math because that was the coal that I, whatever. We have we have 50 going and someone's gonna have fun with it. Maybe it'll be you, because you're really good at it. Now I'm fingers crossing, hoping that these eggs are good. Look at how fast that big guy is making the, the refined ingots compared to a tier three making regular ingots. This is great. I wanted to grab these ingots so we can make a grapple hook before we did anything else. I totally forgot about these and you guys told me that this is the bee's knees, the cat's pajamas. So let's see how this grappling gun works. I assume I just need to put it in like here. Did you see the T-pose? That was good. All right, grapple gun, and wee! Uh-oh, I thought the game crashed. All right, um, hello? Oh, it's got a cooldown. All right, so you can't just Spider-Man around. Oh, and I can't attach that. Can I attach to creatures? No, how about here? There it is. All right, that's kind of cool. You guys said I can move things if I'm encumbered that way. So let's start up these eggs. Now let's hope we get a good one out of this. Come on, meow, Chris, we need to clone you some more oh oh that one's really good workaholic artisan and the work slave that's good all right frozen egg incubate serious workaholic bottomless stomach okay we might be able to start putting some of these together i love how they just kind of ragdoll when you run with them all right those two should make a good one i'll just give them the cake queue up some more flour build another wheat plantation Go collect the resources that have been here for the last hour. <laughs> How much junk is here? Okay, we have 140 coins already. Got 122 pal balls there. Okay, we're keeping going with the coins. This is working so well. And these aren't even leveled up creatures yet. They're overwhelming our carriers so they can't even keep up. My goodness. <laughs> 5,000 gold coins so far. All right, 6,700 and then whatever is put in that chest over here. Oh, another 3,000? I was empty because I used it all on ammo. All right. So we just got 10,450 gold in about an hour. This is nice. Our first egg has been done. They still don't have enough cake. So let's put this in like so. I got it. I got it. Come on. Give me a cool one. I need a cool one. Give me a really good one. And an artisan. All right, an artisan is is good. I just caught a little kitty cat going in the wrong zone. You're not allowed over here, buddy. You have to go make baby kitty cats in here. Also, we have two eggs ready. Nice. You need to go, go blow fire on the cake maker. All right, you're the cake. Stop it. Do I have to remind you that you're making cake? Yeah, I do. Maybe you're done. No, you're not. But yes, another brand new egg is ready for us. Give me these. That's not an egg. You're the egg maker. I'm getting so close on some of these too. Ah, there we go. Some of these get like two or three of the stats I want. Ooh, yeah, that one didn't get any of them. Why? But this one, however. Nope. A stronghold strategist, what's wrong with your parents? They give you all the bad traits. What? Why do, why do you do this to me? Guys, I put the wall there for a reason. So you wouldn't go, why are you so dumb? Get yourself back in the regular spot. Now where'd you go? Bro just disappeared. 
So I had to go make a quartz run, and I've been finding a lot of these eggs. Large frills and eggs. Not the huge I was hoping for. I just thought I saw another one. Yep, right down here. Oh, there's one right there, too. So this one another large. That could be fun. Yep. No huges. I like the huge eggs. They're the favorite of mine. I'm also hoping I brought enough clothes, because it could get real cold here. Look at those fellas. It reminds me of uh, Toothless on whatever that movie was. So I believe this is the quartz? Yes, pure quartz. Is it heavy? It looks heavy. There's also a wumpus over there. I think that's called a wumpus. I'm not exact. Oh, wumpo. Yep, and I have the hiccups. That's not great. Now you picked a fight with him. Oh, he froze me. Do I have to end this? My goodness, I probably won't have to do too much. All right, whatever. Time for a fight scene. Boo! I think I missed. Yeah, that's a tree. And eyeball. Okay, that's not a crit. Wow. One thing I've noticed is that you never, ever, ever, whoa, want to use your mount. Did you just straight up kill him? Oh, that totally missed. No, it died. Shiny has a problem killing things. This place is pretty crazy. Oop, two more eggs. I think there's a boss fight in the middle there. Oh, that's a huge frozen egg. Nice. Oh no, I'm too heavy. What do I not need? What do I not need? I didn't realize these frozen meows are all over up here too. I didn't have to breed them. I thought they were something special and unique. Like this guy. Just kidding, he's not special or unique. What is special and unique is circuit boards. I need 10 of them. I need more polymer. Let's make polymer first. Thankfully I can make 60 of those. That doesn't take any time at long. These Anubis are amazing. And speaking of amazing, let's see what we get in this huge frozen egg. It could be something really cool or something entirely stupid. I am going for the entirely cool. Oh, Mammal Rest Christ. Okay, that's cool. Most of these other things are gonna be pretty boring, I bet. Oh, a Meow Christ, okay. Yeah, that one's got terrible skills. Oh, a worm? Van worm? Oh, and of course, I got a penguin Woo! out of the deal. Oh, I got a Wumpo too. And the reason why I wanted those circuit boards is because we can now get rid of this thing and build production number two. Great. That's longer, isn't it? Why does it have to be longer? I mean, it is the second in the series, but hold up here. <laughs> Are those like little laser grabby claws? That's amazing. This thing's gonna take electricity too, isn't it? Oh boy. Oh wow, that looks real nice. Oh good, yes, mission control, pal box upgrade. Again, that means I can have more pets and we have more eggs. So let's upgrade this real quick. Ooh, built an electronic furnace. okay. Now I'm hoping, I've got good hopes for this one. The parents only have the, the selected stats that we need, so it should be really close to being what we need. And let's go. Let's see in here. Incubate that egg, incubate the egg, incubate the egg. Come on, work slave, serious brave. That's not what I wanted. I don't care if you're brave. I just want you to make gold and lots of it. Actually not bad though. Work slave and serious is pretty good. But now when you're coming from these parents, like that one's almost perfect here. Work slave, artisan, lucky. It's just missing serious, which its parents have. Its mom has that. And this one gives me serious artisan pyromaniac. Why do you get the bad stats? Your parents are amazing. And I guess if we're gonna upgrade our conveyor belt here, we might as well upgrade our pal sphere one back there too. We got a bunch of dinguses that are stuck in the top floor of the house as well. Why do you guys go up there? All right, let's try another one. Will this one be good? Will this one be good? Please be good, please be good. Vanguard and artisan, that is good. That's a good one. Now I just need like a, a lucky work slave with it. There's lucky. We could put these two together. Mm. Oh, serious work slave. So we'll do a little bit of an upgrade on this left, or I guess the right pet now. Neat. Kind of awkward as this Anubis just stands up here and watches the whole time. Like, fella, don't you have anything better to do? And I like how the cat in the top right, it's hard at work, seems to be a good worker. Yeah, that's what they're working on. Making babies. Now we do have a good amount of good pals that we could put in here. They're not the perfect one yet, but we still are getting to that point. There's so much money. This was another cool 16,000. Or was it 6,000? I think I had 10,000 on me. Plus whatever's in this crate. Oh yeah, 500. It is a little annoying. They do their work, but they don't haul when they're when I'm not in this area. So we can just put in a few of these guys because these are the ones that have been breeding down here. Oh wow, and there's a lot of them we don't even have penned up right now. All right, you guys go back. 
We don't need runners in here. Are you kidding me right now? Dainty eaters, muscle heads, motivational leaders, stronghold strategists. We don't need any of that. We need fun things like lucky mind foremans and serious artisans. Almost every one of these has a positive trait, which is incredible. Still not the perfect trait, but they're gonna make so much cash. Watch them over here. They're just gonna start digging like crazy and popping up coins. Or are they better? If not, I totally wasted five hours today. Also, I have no idea what's going on for food. Oh, there's eggs. Oh, eggs, I forgot about that. Yeah, they totally eat eggs. That's why the chickens are here. I see a kitty pounced. Oh, we just got one. Nice. All right, I think they are working pretty quickly. We have some grazing going on. It's going way better than it was before. And this boy is walking back and forth, flying back and forth, I guess, carrying everything in. It's going well. No way. <laughs> no way. No way. No way. I wasn't recording because I've literally gone through, like, I don't even know. Look how many stupid cats there are here. I, like 30 of them. Now if I can... Oh, there it is. Artisan, lucky, workaholic, serious. Now, we could change out the workaholic for work slave, but <laughs> this is about as good as I can get it. There's also one more up here, and I'm refining it. Every one of these pals is getting better and better and better until they just go off and start digging up dirt, but that's okay. They're, they're cats. That's what they're supposed to do. All right, let's see what this one is. I'm hoping this one is the one we're looking for, and it's going to be something dumb. That's actually so close. <laughs> the lucky work slave. Vanguard and stronghold strategist aren't that good. Actually, Vanguard's like the opposite of good. Like, no, it's not Vanguard. There's one of them that's negative 50%. Those are incredible though. I think I did it. <laughs> I, th I think I did it. I've done so much preparation for, I guess it'd be yesterday's stream. Because <laughs> I'm recording this on Monday and it's coming out Saturday. I've been working on all sorts of spheres and things. We have so many uh, like charcoal and other things that are going on. So it's not been a wasted day. But I do want to go put these guys in the base. Should we try to get a couple more? Let's just get a couple more. So I'm almost out of cake. I'm just going to put that one in and they should immediately eat it and then poop out an egg. That's how eggs are made, if you're wondering. This one just got ready to... So that'll be my last two, and we're gonna see if I can get anything better, which I seriously doubt. Also, we have a lot of guys making resources again because I went through close to 10,000 stone. Also, I don't know where I got the scorching egg from. Uh, actually, I do. It was way over there. It's gonna be something stupid. Yeah, like a phlegm bell. That's not stupid. That might be one of the cutest ones. But this one, this one's gonna be solid. Serious, lucky, work slave, capacitor. That's a solid one. The capacitor is pointless, but I mean, those other three are huge. That's it. <laughs> That's it. We just got the best one possible. I mean, there, there's a few combinations that make them really good, but having that, uh, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I've been at this for literally hours right now. And that's it. The workaholic is super good because it keeps that sand faster and the work speed is plus 30. 50, 65% plus less drop. <laughs> All right, let's take these fellas out. I also really want to see how fast money has been because it's been roughly an hour since I went to the other base, which is right up here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all this junk. All right, we're starting with 7,300. I got to clean it all up. Look at that. We've already passed 1,000. We haven't even got around one circle here. Listen to that sound. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> come on, buddy. Come on. I don't want my inventory to fill up. Actually, gold coins don't fill it, so that's good. I'm going to get rid of the Vixies here, I think, to just to make more money. 7,000 in an hour, and we're not even all the way there yet. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. These aren't even the best pals. 7,900, we literally just doubled our money. There might be a few, what is that turtle doing here? Hold on, friend. You're not my friend, pal. Kind of want to see all these cats go off on them. <laughs> Yo, kitties! Kitty power! That's hilarious. <laughs> Should we tame it? No, we're not taming that. You don't get to come into my fort. That was awesome. All the kitties just went mad. All right, Vixies, I apologize. Sorry, not sorry, but I have to replace you with better things. You know what I should do is just remove everything out and get the best of the best in. I do still need the chickens for food too. We need the chickens and we need the van worms for picking it up. 
All right, let's grab the two really good ones here. I mean, that's not the really good one. Uh, that one's good. Serious workaholic. We have a, yep, that one's awesome. That one's also awesome. A lucky, we might need that, but there's the good one right there. I'm gonna name you, what should I name you? You guys will have to drop a name down here. I'm gonna name her Lucky Charm. So we always know that it took me seven hours to get her. I'm gonna fill it up with two. If they have two, then I'm gonna keep them. Lucky and Artisan. Yep, Work Slave Serious. Oh, that one's decent. Lucky Work Slave. Work Slave and Artisan. <laughs> These things are gonna make so much money. Oh, there's a good one too. But it has a Vanguard. I mean, that's not great, but I'll take it. There we go. 14 kitty cats all doing the diggy dig. They're gonna make so much cash. It's gonna be fantastic. They're already working. I kind of want to let it run for an hour, but uh, my day has ended and it's time for me to go home. So thank you, my friends, for watching this video. That was awesome. I had so much fun and I hope you did too. Thanks for watching. Keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Splatter Sax, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brett, Dalton C, Scatter D, Mr. Cripple One, Baton Please, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Link Hewitt, Tyler J, Nitro VR, Nitrox, Wyatt H, Honor Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippias, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Ritla Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Baxter, Ral, VC Engineer, Scars Marex, Spencer T, Whiskey, and YH.